um, and then Meteor against Ego. Oh god, we are uh, we're already playing our bad guys. Yeah, yeah Meteor and took it over Etho 2-1, and he is fighting Master Mario right now. That's oh, drop it down. Oh, but that. just a little bit too far. Unfortunate for for uh, Charlie the King. Yeah, I like that. They just went right into it. Who needs to wait? They want to play. Okay, down smashing at the ledge. Trying to catch the Peach Bomber. It's a good tool uh, to beat out the Peach Bomber. Wow, and up smash is going to scoop up. Ooh, and he even gets the... He challenged the recovery with Fox Flash or Wolf Flash and then bounced off the stage. Uh, Raza was not expecting that option. I, uh, Charlie, rather. Copy the moves. Yeah, back air connects. And now forcing Razo in to recover low once again. Astra into the air, actually looking for that forward smash. Looking for another one saying, hey, come challenge me. That's right, come challenge me indeed. And now we get the cross up Nair connecting. You see a down throw. And Razo with these lower these higher percents. Gotta be careful for those for the uh, the F tilt. Yeah, watch them claws right there. Charlie taking that stock off of Razo. Uh, uh, great forward air gonna answer right back. Last stock a piece now. Interesting uh stall. He did run off parasol. Oh. oh no! Oh! Oh no! Okay, he's been able to make it back. Luckily, Charlie was able to get the trade from the Wolf Flash or the Fire Wolf, uh, which will allow him to get, make it back to stage. Oh, good conversion! Easy damage coming from Charlie the King. I'm not sure what these S or down smashes are attempting because Charlie keeps doing them too far away to reach the right. But it feels like it's supposed to be like. Respecting Parasol from that distance? I think he's actually trying to catch Parasol's hitbox because it does poke through the stage. Okay. You'll see Razo like Parasol really close to the stage uh, just to clip Charlie. Well, I know the hitbox comes out, but does the hurtbox move through the stage too? I mean, it looks like that's what he's trying to catch. Maybe. Okay, Wolf Flash back to the stage and a forward air going to connect for Razo. Oh, the snipe! He is still alive, but no, not a lot of invincibility there. Goes too high with the side be on stage. Razo ready with the neutral air. Mm -hmm. and that was extremely close, especially for Charlie forfeiting a stock so early in yeah. the set. Yeah, definitely really unfortunate they SD'd so early, but thankfully it is game one. He has all the time in the or all the time in the world really to bring this one back in his favor. That's right, but now Charlie opting to go to choose Final Destination as his counter pick. So at Final Destination, he's going to eliminate those platforms, which is kind of interesting because we usually see Charlie making use of those platforms more than his opponents. Okay, a couple. Ooh, the up air juggles. Charlie needs to land. He finally does it. say at 43%. Throw it air into the neutral air for Charlie, but you know it's not the same kind of damage that Razo is putting on. Mm -hmm. These ledge traps will just continue to come out for Razo. Oh, and he was going for that golf swing. Really smart for from Razo because the golf club will actually hit below the ledge. Uh, if your opponent isn't aware of that, they may just kind of recover unsafely and just straight up lose a stock. Oh, great timing on the get up there. Avoiding the down smash and actually punishing it with an up smash of his own. Charlie right now coming out strong. Mm -hmm. Retreating to the uh, to the ledge and using blaster. Ooh, Firewolf just ate up that turner. Right, great recovery there from Charlie. He is able to get back on stage, but not for very long. Razo. Punishing a whiff grab with a grab of his own. He is able to take that stock with the back throw. And now we're seeing a 0% up the piece. Can Razo find his opening? Interesting. Just jumps in front of Charlie's face with the counter. And Charlie, you know, kind of autopilot some dash attacks. Yeah, but now Charlie is keeping Razo on the left side of the stage with a Peach Bomber. Ooh, good wall jump at the Wolf Flash. Mixing up his recovery. 
Oh, there's that F smash that Charlie loves to use. Okay, Naring catching the turnip along with the uh, with the Nair throwing out. Ooh, he's holding onto the turnip. He's dropping it, trying for some item combos. He says, you know what? He can do it. I can do it too. That's right. Everybody actually has access to item combos. You oh, know an aggressive recovery from Razo. He he did new does his second jump onto stage while Charlie King was charging up smash. Yeah, very aggressive right there. Charlie trying to find a way off of this ledge right now, but it's not working out too well for him. Shy. Hey man, everyone, everything gets parried. You know KO Punch can get parried? It really can. Yes, it can. Everything gets parried. <laughs> Unblockable, uncounterable, but you can parry it. Hey. I mean, I guess it's <laughs> when you stop blocking, so it makes sense. Yeah, that's that's the risk reward. And you know what? Risk reward? Firewolf well, has a lot of risk reward. Look, all I'm saying is if I was a little bit maybe some parry KO Punch, they won the game right there. <laughs> I see you just unplug and walk yeah, away. You know what? You win. <laughs> yep, you got it, dude. <laughs> okay, and you know what? Razo's got that stock as well. Good damage. Wow, it only, only looked like three hits, and I put 56 damage yeah, that's on Razo. Yeah, that's power up. Whoa. Yeah, and Razo showing his own power with a quick combo. Spot dodging back to back right there. Quite literally, neither of them facing each other either, so they aren't getting these grabs that they were looking for. That's right. But both those players, both these characters have really good back airs, <laughs> especially out of shield. Wow, that kill it from just killed him. Kicked her straight in the face. Like I know, I know. Smash said that that was gonna kill. I just didn't believe it. You know, you can't believe everything you see. And I didn't believe that until Rosal. Like actually lost the stock. Yeah, with all the false finish cameras we've seen in this game, that was what I expected to be one of them. <laughs> you know, I do <laughs> like the foul destination pick here for Charlie. It seemed pretty solid. Ooh. Yeah, but now Razo is opting back to go back to Final Destination. I'm actually kind of surprised by that. I feel like, you know, maybe a different stage would have been played, but. Razo may need to see that Andy's sticking with it. We are back on to final destination for this game number three. Mm -hmm. Getting a nair to down tilt. Now Charlie answering back with a few forward airs. Oh, oh my god, he just why sent would you a do message. That though? <laughs> no, it is about the message saying, Razo, I don't need this stock. I just want to make sure you don't have one. Yeah, apparently no one no one likes three stocks. <laughs> Charlie is about the two stock format. <laughs> because I mean, that's exactly what he got. I'm still playing Smash 4 right now. <laughs> well, percents are about even. Stocks definitely even. Okay, a lot of Nairs are <laughs> coming out from both our players. But a down tilt into Nair will connect for Razo. Oh, expecting that dash attack to cross up. It can be hard to tell when Fox or Wolf's dash attack is going to cross up. Yeah. It's just really if he throws out the the, ooh, the uh, early hitbox of the dash attack or not. Using oh. another Wolf Flash in an aggressive format. Yeah, very flashy play here from Charlie. But it's not paying off for him. Razo, they would take the lead now. Okay, soft hit in there. It's going to reward Charlie the ledge. Oh, not spacing out the, the Nair correctly. And Razo timing his neutral get up, allowing him to make it back to stage. Getting knocked off again. And what are you doing, Charlie? You're crazy. Wolf Flash. Oh! oh. Not, not from across stage, though. Not from across stage. I go, but it was definitely a great recovery. And what, Char what Charlie was going for earlier was that, you know, we see a lot for his characters with kind of worse recoveries where Wolf can up be straight up and he'll just kill off the side and if your recovery is not good enough it can't really do much about it and speaking of not being able to recover there goes the turnip snipe Charlie losing game 3 here I'm sorry I'm, I'm sorry I think he's regretting that Wolf flash on the first stock well it's like you said it's, it's about sending a message the message is we're going back to final destination yeah I don't think the message was received on the part of Raza right? You know, Charlie sent him a message saying, hey, don't mess with me. Razo never got it. Return to sender. It's like, Razo just answered right back like, yo, eat your vegetables. Just eat your vegetables. Stop flashing around. Hold this turn up. But 
You see a good juggle coming out from Charlie. Ooh, answering right back Razo with a bunch of uh, nares. Charlie right now just ledge trapping with these back airs make it difficult for Razo to get out. I like the runoff there. He knows Razo's in the right spot. I, I understand it, but I don't like it very much for Charlie. Yeah, he was trying to cover the ledge uh, with the Firewolf, but because Razo still had invincibility, it just... It wasn't going to work. Just the angle that he recovered at, it, yeah. it wasn't going to catch him. But down air does connect while Charlie hangs uh, onto the ledge Ooh. just a little bit too long. Ooh, and no punish on that recovery from Raza. I'm very surprised right now. That was honestly just recovered into his face and got away with it. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh that's, those turnips almost caught Charlie. Grazing the hairs of Wolf. His wolf fur. Oh, that was a good pivot grab, but not using the back throw. What? And a parry on the back throw. Very brave from Razo, especially he didn't even get a punish on So, unfortunate, but that is going to be it. Two nails, two stocks. That's all it takes. Now forward air connecting. You see Charlie using that combo quite a bit where he does the, the forward air nair to air to tilt, especially yeah. around the ledge. It can either link into an F-tilt or a grab based on the character. Mm. So but like, we see it a, a little bit more because he just wants to set up for ledge traps. Yeah. Yeah, it's very good damage, very good combo. Charlie, you know, has his brain bows down. Oh, dash attack whiffing again after the ledge. And that just results in Razo getting a reversal and taking the ledge for himself. All right, stalling with the Wolf Flash, able to avoid another turn up. And Razo finds himself in, a, in the advantage position, continuing to push Charlie off stage. Ooh. I, I, feel like, I feel like Charlie's like crossing up in hopes that he's going to be able to catch Razo off guard with an up tilt because it just comes out so quick. Yeah, honestly, it's kind of reminiscent of like Snake. Where, like, you just throw it out, it actually hits deceptively high, it hits through a lot of platforms. Mm -hmm. uh, a pretty uh, solid kill option. Also, floating underneath Cloud right now. That's right, no invincibility for you, Charlie. You're gonna chase me to the other side of the stage. But a Nair, cross up Nair does work for Charlie. And there's that Parasol poking through the stage again. There's the up tilt. Yeah, but Razo actually low profile here with the down tilt, kind of just going much there. Neither player uh, connects. Okay, down throw into a back air. Easy bread and butter and gets the trade, but Charlie is going to be able to make it back to stage. That's the important part for Charlie right there. Isn't it, though? Because <laughs> right now, the important thing for Charlie is he's got to get rid of that stock and run off in there is the answer. Yeah, actually, surprisingly traded with the parasol. But it does get the job done. Down tilt into the photo and not going to connect for Razo. Oh. But missed tech. A good snipe from Razo and no tech from Charlie as he was not ready. 3-1. 3-1 Razo advancing to grand finals. Let's go, Aie. Who? 